So I decided to go ahead and imprison one of these mind flares. Uh, word of advice, if you're trying to get one because you have to reflect the magic back at it in order to create that prism opportunity, confuse it because it just won't do what you want it to do. It's just a bit too smart. Anyways, all that said, done. Uh, yeah, just cataloging. Really, that's all I'm doing here. Uh, I'm gonna leave it with Seraphy. Uh, that said, all that done. There is something that we need to do, you see. I saw this green crystal. I wanted to use it. I wanted to access it because it's a little bit of a shortcut to this little Kazuo beast. Oh man, look at that. You got... You got Bacon, who's a regular behemoth, and you Alrighty, got these things. Go. I know what you're saying. Do I really need to watch this? No. Well, that was something you didn't need to see. That's why I cut it. It was pretty smart on my part, if I do say so myself. I digress, you know. Gotta get that clear, Chris. Anyways. Uh, red crystal, the fire crystal. Where'd you go? All over the place, apparently. Um, I don't know if I'm ready to do that. Give me a second. I need to figure out if there's anything left on this floor. I don't think there was. Oh, wait. No, there was. There was a earth crystal, a water crystal. Oh, my God. Options. Options I am not ready for. I, I can't explain it. There's something. Was I already here? Did I already go this way? Hold on. Uh, well, apparently I was. Yeah, this this all looks very familiar. I mean, especially if I took what the contents of that treasure chest were. Oh, you guys again. Oh, yeah. I'm not dealing with that anymore. And neither should you guys. So that's why we're just gonna keep on moving on. Uh, so if the water crystal led me to somewhere completely irrelevant, don't really give a damn about, uh, just don't care. Where's the earth crystal go? <laughs> oh, how lovely. Uh, so really my only option was the fire crystal. Fine, let's do it. Take me wherever you go. Over here, I see something that can get smashed. And that's why I didn't revert Gildum. Because I knew eventually I was going to have to do this again. To get an elixir, well, that's, that's not too bad. I can live with that. So now that we've finished that and can move on with the part, uh, I'm going to just go up here continue on to the next place because you know progress also i've expanded the mirage boards for everyone involved mainly my own mirages i guess that's kind of self-explanatory don't really need to go on anywhere with that a uh, new area means new mirages oh moving on uh, let's see, we got some broken pillars. Who knew just how far the twin adventurers had come? Who, indeed? Why are you talking in the third the person? Maybe they just feel like it. You ever think about that, Tama? Uh, I don't think I can go anywhere with that, so... Uh, moving on. It looks like we got a bridge to cross. And... Man, I have no idea where any of this is going. But I'm fine with it, you know. We must be getting near the top. This place feels less the welcoming the further we climb. The mirages are getting stronger as we go, too. Yeah, stay on your toes. Use a teleport stone if you need to turn the back, and you can access the prism case via the seraphone. Well, I mean, that's pretty elementary stuff. I've been doing that ever since God knows when. I digress. Uh, Peepers has led me to a chest. Two chests. With a lightning spell stone. That's pretty good. And an ice spell stone. What are you telling me, game? What am I supposed to make of this? I'm gonna run to I'm gonna run into an enemy that's weak against those two elements. Is this a clue? 
Should I pay attention to this? Is this a subtle hint? So many questions and I have no answers. There's only one way to find out. So when they said mirages are getting stronger, I think what they meant to say is they're starting to come in greater stacks. Mainly a threes. Which isn't anything new, it's just, man, they're just starting to do that a lot more often. Uh, I guess it's just slightly troublesome. All that said, nothing to really worry about. I mean, I'm still I'm still more than capable of handling anything that they throw my way. Also, I got bacon. Once he's a little bit up, I will totally be abusing the hell out of him. Right, let's... I have a question. What is any of this? Oh, man. You wouldn't dare. Earth resistance. And I have to have a weight of 10. Oh, man. I was not ready for this. Uh, Cheshire, surely you can help me out. And then... Peeper? No, not Peepers. Spider Mike, uh... Well, I guess I'll use Spider Mike, he has a good basis. Uh, I just need... And yeah, alright. This wasn't anything to really sweat over, it's, it's all good. I got it. Gilm totally had this. A little bit of an awkward stack, but I can dig it. I, I mean, I'm just saying Cheshire and Spider Mikey, they're kind of the same size. Okay, now that that's all Earthified. Because I'm totally making that word now, Earthified. Uh, there's nothing over here. I don't know why I'm sounding like this. Okay, you know what? Earth Crystal, take me wherever the hell you're taking me. Over here. Take me over here. So I can check over here to nothing so I can go over here to the path forward as I was saying while this loading screen happens forward is a very nice direction to go because there's what I'm sorry this just kind of happened out of nowhere I wasn't paying attention uh Kazooie kit Kazooie kit I, I sw you know what I have a better idea instead of using Libra uh yeah okay I've already Libra these guys Atlantic counterattack that's not too difficult but unfortunately I already got bacon so you guys not that important but in order to make an example of you lightning do your thing Lon, Rain, you need me? Oh, <laughs> female cloud has it going on. Um, I don't hate lightning that much. Certainly nowhere near the level of snow, but at the same time, I mean, Jesus Christ, you did quintuple digits of damage. I mean, that that's impressive. Uh, I guess not so much if we were playing Final oh, Fantasy yeah. 13, because the numbers get pretty ridiculous to the point where I don't think they matter so much as it's just the uh, ends. It, it, it the ends to justify the means. There we go. Uh, Gilm trying to put all his thoughts in order. Okay, we got another clear Chris. I probably could go all the way back to the beginning, but something tells me there's like one of these little quick teleport crystals coming up. The one that kind of goes to the top and teleports you all the way to the bottom. Uh, just just built into this whole entire tower as a way of quick traveling because it's so gigantic it's been what like five parts into it and we have only progressed so much where are we now wherever it is it's the crawling with powerful mirages i can feel it too let's be careful i know what you're saying geldum shouldn't you cut it and normally you'd be right i would cut it but uh, i feel like there's just a smidge i can do like this. I told you this was gonna happen. Or at least I was alluding to it. I knew it. So yeah, we got midway point and then all the way to the top. Normally I'd cut it to go all the way back down here, but... 
You responded. And so, I was just gonna go back and do all this thing, because there's a lot of gimme golems, so with the Claire Chris and I got two of them, get the fuck out of here. Because I hate you, Gimme Golem. You're just a means to pad out this whole lengthy adventure. Uh, and another one here to block my path. Well, you know what? Get the fuck out of here because I already got your little MacGuffin to progress. Oh man. Do I dare? Well, I guess it's too late to ask that question because I'm already going. Oh man, what? Oh boy, the ma the mini map is kind of blocking it. There we go. Um, next time, what what could possibly go wrong?